Today, I'm doing a Minecraft mob battle with my teacher, but we're using skibbity mobs. And what Mr. Wilson doesn't know is that I'm secretly gonna be cheating with this one-way glass wall to see exactly what he spawns in. Anyways, Mr. Wilson, are you ready to begin this skibbity mob battle? Yep, I've got my chicken on my head and I'm ready to beat you. And wait a minute, guys, why does he have a chicken on his head? Okay, whatever. Well, anyways, Mr. Wilson, we've each got a chest on our side and inside of the chest, we've got all of the skibbity mobs that we can use. Oh yeah, these look really OP. Yep, and we've each got five minutes to spawn in our mob, so good luck! Alright, guys, it is now the first round of the mob battle, and before we go ahead and spawn in our own mob, let's look through our one-way glass wall and see what Mr. Wilson's gonna be spawning in, so we can spawn the perfect counter. Alright, I was looking in that chest, and I think this is the best mob we can spawn in. This is a missile toilet, and it looks so OP. And wait, what the heck? Wait, Mr. Wilson's spawning in the missile toilet on the first round, and oh gosh, wait, this guy looks super strong. Why is he looking at me like that? Oh my gosh, and but his missiles are sticking through the wall. Yeah, these toilets are so OP. I'm pretty sure this is all I need. And come on, chicken, let's make sure to like have fun this round. What in the world, guys? I can't believe Mr. Wilson is spawning in the missile toilets on the first round. These guys are so strong. But wait a minute. I think I actually might know one mob that we can use to counter these. And that is the Titan Cameraman, because I'm pretty sure he's like the strongest mob in Skibbity right now. So let's just go inside of our chest over here. And I'm pretty sure this one is a spawn egg. And now let's just go ahead and spawn one in. And let's see what this guy looks like and oh my gosh what the heck this is what the titan cameraman looks like i had no idea he was gonna be this big and op and wait guys look he's even got like a stone sword over here but guys look at him he's got like wings on the back and he's even got these rocket thrusters over here i think it's definitely safe to say that we are 100 gonna be winning this round let's just go ahead and spawn in a few more of these titan cameramen and there we go that should be enough titan cameramen and wow guys our army looks absolutely crazy just look at all of this stuff from up here. Well, anyways, Mr. Wilson, are you ready to drop down the walls? Because uh, my army sure is. Yeah, I'm ready for the first round. I'm also ready to win. And come on, Jacob, let's win this first round. Okay, Mr. Wilson, we'll see about that. Uh, I don't think you're going to win, but yeah, whatever. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and drop down the walls in three. Two, one, let's go! Come on, chicken, attack them! And wait, Mr. Wilson, you guys are getting absolutely destroyed! Oh my gosh, your guys just killed my chicken! And whoa, these guys are so massive! Wait, they killed your chicken? Oh, that's kind of funny. And wait, Mr. Wilson, they killed all of your missile toilets, except for this one over here! Oh, this is like the best one. I fed him some special coffee today. You fed him special coffee? That's kind of weird, but here we go, Mr. Wilson. He's about to die any second now, and let's go, GG's. What in the world? Um, you cheated! Um, these aren't real mobs. These are just fake. Wait, fake? What are you talking about, Mr. Wilson? You can clearly see them here. They're not fake mobs. I, I, I spawned them in fair and square. Yeah, Dash, but these guys are way too big. These are like over the size limit, I'm pretty sure. Wait, what? Over the size limit? What size limit are you talking about? There's no size limits in mob battles. Uh, yeah, there is. It's in the mob battle rules. There's a size limit. Oh my gosh, Mr. Wilson. No, there isn't. You know what, guys? Comment down below who you think won this first round. Well, anyways, let's just move on to the next round. All right, guys. Anyways, it is now the next round and... Of course, before we go ahead and spawn in our mobs, let's look through our one-way glass again and see what Mr. Wilson's gonna be spawning in. All right, I've been doing a lot of research and I've actually been looking around and I have a perfect idea. Why don't we use this glitch skibbity toilet? What the heck? And wait, Mr. Wilson is spawning in glitch skibbities? And last round we lost because Dash had so many mobs, so we're gonna spawn in like a ton of these. What in the world? Oh my gosh, guys, these glitch skibbities look crazy. I've never even seen one of these in my life before. What the heck? Oh my gosh, just look at their heads. These things look terrible. This one's head is sticking through the wall. All right, well, hmm, this is gonna be a pretty tough one to counter, but wait, I think I actually might know someone that could help. And that is the Skibbity Scientist. So let me go ahead and grab his spawn egg. And honestly, if anyone is gonna be able to counter these guys, it's gonna be the Scientist Toilet because he probably like invented them or something. So anyways, now let's just go ahead and spawn him in. And uh, wait, this is what he looks like? What in the world even is this? Like his neck is uh, very deformed. Dude does not have good neck posture. And wait a minute, what? What in the world is this big metal claw in the back? Wait, this is probably what he uses to, like, do experiments and stuff with. Well, uh, guys, honestly, I may have made a mistake spawning in this guy. This guy looks pretty weak. I'm not sure if he's gonna be able to take out all of those ginormous glitch 
have any toilets, but I guess we can spawn in a few more of them. And wait, before you spawn in any more mobs. Wait, what? You can talk? Of course I can. I'm a realistic skimmity toilet. What in the world? Well, uh, wait, you were saying something? Yeah, before you spawn in any more mobs in, you should actually listen to me. I'm the smartest skimmity toilet. Well, you may be the smartest, but uh, you look kind of weak, I'm not going to lie. Like, those glitch skimmities could probably destroy you. Well, I may not be the strongest, but I am the smartest, and I am thinking of a way to beat those pesky toilets over there. Wait, wait, wait. You know what way to beat those guys? Oh, perfect. I was kind of out of hope. Uh, well, what were you thinking? I was thinking we build a machine to flatten them out, and I just come along and hit them, and then they die. Wait, a machine to flatten them out, and uh, how are we going to do that? Well, you just listen to my instructions, and you build it. Oh, uh, okay, sure. Well, what do I have to do first? All right, first you need two pistons. Two pistons? Uh, okay, let me go ahead and grab those. All right, and do I just place them like this? No, 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 you stupid human. You've done it all wrong. Uh, wait, what the hell? How am I supposed to do it then? You know what? Here, you take the pistons. Well, I can't take the pistons. I don't have any arms. Uh, okay, well, where do I have to place the pistons then? Well, you need to place one right here. Uh, okay, so like this? Yes, and get rid of this one right here. Uh, okay. And then you take one of these. Uh, what in the world is this? That is the flattening device, and this is going to send it at them and make them all flatten. Oh, uh, okay, so do I just, like, put it over here? Yep, that's exactly what you do. Now we need to connect them up. Oh, perfect. So do I just go ahead and grab some redstone? Uh, no, what do we look like? Peasants? Redstone for peasants. We don't use that. Use one of these. Wait, what the heck is this? Wait, a restrictive transporter? What in the world is this? It is what we need. Just place it down on the pistons and it should work. Uh, okay. I guess I'll just go ahead and place them like this. And, uh, wait, where do I have to connect them to? But you need to take this and then connect it with the lever. Uh, okay. So do I just, like, put this thing over here and then go ahead and connect all of these to it just like that? And then I just put the lever on top of it? Yep, that's all you need to do. And why don't you go ahead and flick that lever? Oh, uh, okay. Let's see what it does. And, whoa! Wait, did it work? Wait, what? What the heck? All of Mr. Wilson's mobs are flat now. What in the world happened? Why are all my mobs flat? What happened? Oh my gosh, guys. Wait, this is actually so funny. Like, they're all just like one pixel wide, except when you look at them from here, they're like a full skinny zone. That is actually hilarious. Oh my gosh, what happened? I think I spawned in too many and they got too cramped. Oh my gosh, guys. Mr. Wilson thinks it's because he spawned in too many and they got cramped. Ah, excellent. I knew that would work. Yeah, man. That worked pretty well. And wait a minute. I have an idea. We do still have a little bit of time left before the walls drop and since all of mr wilson's mobs are like flat and probably super weak now why don't we go over to his side and mess with them a little bit so let's just go ahead and grab ourselves a potion of invisibility and let's just go ahead and splash it on ourselves so that mr wilson can't see us and now let's head over to his side all right guys and perfect here we are on mr wilson's side and wait a minute what in the world is this guy doing oh man i can't believe my mobs flattened out this is so stupid but at least i have my poop trophy that doesn't flatten and wait what? Mr. Wilson has a poop trophy? What in the world is this guy doing? All right, well, Mr. Wilson's always been pretty weird, but wait, I have an idea. Let's go ahead and grab this item called the electric hyper discharger, and let's just go ahead and try shooting it at some of Mr. Wilson's mobs. Uh, so here we go. Let's see what it does. And whoa, guys, that was crazy. What in the world just happened? What was that? That was like lightning. Oh my gosh, Mr. Wilson must be so confused. Uh, let's go ahead and do that again on these guys. Here we go, and boom. What was that? I just think some like beam of lightning come down and hit my mom. Oh my gosh, guys, this is too funny. Oh man, everything is going weird today. Maybe it's these toilets because they are the glitch toilets. They're probably like glitching out. And oh my gosh, guys, right, I just remembered that these are the glitch toilets, so that's like a perfect cover-up story for anything weird that happens. Well, anyways, guys, this electric hyper discharger is pretty cool, but I'm pretty sure this one over here, the arc translator, is actually more powerful. Let me just go ahead and grab this bad boy, and let's try firing this at Mr. Wilson's mobs, and whoa, it just damaged multiple of them at once. Let's do it a few more times. What in the world is that? And wait, there's a weapon in this guy. Oh, wait, guys. Oh, no, I forgot. Since I'm invisible, Mr. Wilson can see the weapons, but he can't see me, but he can still see the floating weapons. This isn't good. Wait, where did that go? I think that was what was hitting my mobs. I think, like, something is glitching out. I think they're, like, transporting weapons from other universes. Oh, gosh, guys. Okay, we're being a little bit too suspicious. I gotta be more careful about that. Well, anyways, I'm not done here quite yet. I think there's still a few more weapons that we should try out. And wait a minute, what about the 
photon emitter. All right, so now let's just pull out this bad boy and fire. Let's go. And whoa, this one's insane. And what in the world just happened? Like four of my moms died. Oh my gosh, guys, this is way too funny. But honestly, guys, these blasters over here are getting a bit boring. I think we need to step it up a notch. So why don't we go ahead and grab one of these frag grenades instead? Let me just go ahead and grab one of these. And I'm pretty sure what this will do is just do a bunch of damage to Mr. Wilson's mobs all at once. So here we go. Let's go ahead and throw it. And oh my gosh, guys, it just made a huge hole in his platform. What in the world just happened? My arena just blew up. Uh, these glitch toilets are so glitchy. I've got to get rid of these. And wait, guys. Oh my gosh, we've done it. Mr. Wilson is now getting rid of his own mobs. I'm spawning in a new batch of these guys. All these old ones need to get away. Oh my gosh, guys, this is so funny. I can't believe we just made Mr. Wilson get rid of all of his mobs. And I think he's going to spawn in more, but this is way too funny. And there we go. That's the last of them. And now let's spawn in some more of these. And what in the world? Why are these still flat? These are so glitchy. Oh my gosh, guys, this is way too funny. But yeah, okay, we should probably get back over to our side before we do anything more suspicious. And perfect, guys. Here we are on our side again. And wait a minute. What the heck is the scientist toilet doing? Hold on. Let me quickly grab myself a milk bucket so that I can make myself not invisible anymore. And let's go see what this guy's up to. And there we go. The machine is fully built. Oh, hi. Welcome back, human. The machine is fully built. Wait, what is this? Uh, it's just a machine I built that should help with our mob battle. Wait, it should help with the mob battle? Wait, what the heck does all this do? Well, it's hard to explain, but as soon as the walls drop, it will evaporate all of those glitch skibbities. Wait, 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 wait. So you're saying this one machine can take out all of those glitch skibbities over there? Yep, it's more than just one machine. It's a bunch of different wires and cables and different machines combined together perfectly because I am the smartest skibbity. Uh, okay, well, if you say so, I was about to spawn in a bunch more of you scientist toilets. No, but no, 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 there's no need to do that. I am perfectly more than enough. Uh, okay, well, yeah, if you say so, I, I guess I'll just leave it up to you, but you better not fail me, okay? We have to win this mob battle against Mr. Wilson. All right, I won't fail you, but you better let me free after this mob battle. Oh, yeah, sure. I'll, I'll let you, like, out in the open land, I guess. But, uh, yeah, well, anyways, I guess since all this is ready, I'll, I'll ask Mr. Wilson if he's ready to drop the walls. All right, well, anyways, Mr. Wilson, are you ready to drop down the walls? Because, uh, I sure am. Yeah, I'm very ready, and you're going down this round, Dash. Okay, we'll see about that. Well, anyways, here, I'm gonna go ahead and drop them down in three, two, one, let's go! Uh what in the world is this guy? And what is this machine right here? Oh, well, uh, this is the Skibbity Scientist. And uh, don't worry, this machine is going to take out all of your guys. I'm definitely going to win. Uh, Dash, this doesn't even look like it's doing anything. Uh, no, 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 no. Just trust the scientists over here. It it's it's going to work. He just has to, like, uh, deactivate it or something. Uh I hit the button, but it's not working. What do you mean it's not working? Come on, this was our only hope at winning. I'm trying my hardest. Let me try configuring something. Uh, Dash, this is embarrassing. You're kind of losing. No, no, no. Just give it like a, a few more seconds. I just need a few seconds to configure this. And uh, wait a minute, scientists, what are you doing? Why are you fighting them yourselves? Uh, and wait, my scientist just died. What the heck? Uh, Dash, is that all you had? And what in the world was that? His machine just blew up. What in the world? How did his machine just blow up? Uh, I don't know, but I guess that means I win the second round, right? Oh my gosh, you know, yeah, sure, it does, but, oh, man, I can't believe I lost that round. I really thought that scientist guy was gonna win it for us. Yes, I think the only thing that scientist was certified in was being dumb, because look at him, he just blew up his own machine, he didn't even do anything. Uh, well, you know, I I'm sure it was, like, a mistake or something, well, whatever, let's just move on to the next round. All right, guys, it is now the next round, and, man, I can't believe that scientist guy let us down. I really thought he was gonna help us win that round, but I guess not. Well, anyways, let's see what Mr. Wilson's gonna be spawning this time. All right, I've been reading a bunch more books, and now that I've read these, I'm pretty sure that this is the right mob. Yes, it's the TV woman. We're doing so good this round. And wait, what? Mr. Wilson is spawning in the TV woman? And oh my gosh, look at how many he spawned in. Oh my gosh, guys, I don't even know what to use to counter these things. Uh, hello? And, uh, wait, what the heck? You're back? Of course I am. I made clones of myself. Wait, what in the world? Wait, if you made clones of yourself? Well, wait, since you're back, they, why'd that machine blow up? You were supposed to help us win. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry about that, but I can make it up to you. Wait, what? You can? Yeah, I am going to show you my newest invention. I call it the Skibbity Parasite. And what in the world is that? Wait, uh, wait, why is it going towards me? Uh, is, he, is he friendly? Yeah, he's friendly for you, but not for those pesky TV women. What in the world? And wait, is that his tongue sticking out? Oh my, this thing looks disgusting. Yep, and we have so many more to spawn in. Oh my gosh. Well, wait a minute. What do these things even do? Well, pretty much they infect a target, and once they're inside, they destroy. What in the 
small world. Okay, well, these guys seem pretty cool, but they are a little bit small. Are you sure that's not going to be a problem? Oh, yeah, the smaller the better. It'll make it easier for them to creep in. Uh, okay, well, if you say so. Well, I guess we've got our army settled out now. Well, anyways, guys, I guess now that our entire army is settled, let's go check out what Mr. Wilson's doing. And wait, what in the world? Did this guy really build a house on his side? And now I have a place to read and a fancy pool, so let's go read books because Dash takes forever. What in the world? I do not take forever. Ever, I took a standard amount of time to set up my army, okay? Mr. Wilson is just, like, really fast, I guess. But, guys, this is a perfect opportunity to go and prank Mr. Wilson. What if we go, like, blow up his house or something? Let's quickly go ahead and grab ourselves another potion of invisibility. And perfect, now we're invisible. And now let's just head over onto Mr. Wilson's side again. All right, perfect. And here we are. And it looks like all of Mr. Wilson's mobs are, like, trying to fight my mobs through the walls. Uh, I guess they're pretty excited to fight. But, anyways, let's head inside of Mr. Wilson's house and see what he's doing here. All right, that's enough reading for now. Time to jump into the and pool. Wait, what? He's going to the pool? Oh, gosh. Okay, let's go follow him. And dive in. And there we go. Ah, oh, it feels so great. And what in the world? Man, I can't believe Mr. Wilson really built a pool on his side in the middle of a mob battle. But wait, there's a perfect idea for a prank. What if we go ahead and grab ourselves a little bit of fake water? And now, guys, pretty much what fake water is, is it just looks like normal water, but it's actually extremely poisonous. So if we just go over here, we can go ahead and replace some of Mr. Wilson's pool water with this poisonous water and perfect. Now, what in the world is that? Happening. Oh my gosh, I almost died. What in the world happened to my water? Oh my gosh, guys, this is so funny. Mr. Wilson must be so confused. Uh, Dash, what's going on? Uh, wait, what do you mean, Mr. Wilson? There's nothing weird going on on my side. I was just in my bowl and the water just tried to kill me. Wait, the water tried to kill you? That's kind of weird. Wait, Mr. Wilson, when was the last time you cleaned out your pool? Oh, it was just some old water. I saved it from four years ago. Wait, wait, you saved water from four years ago to put in your pool? Well, no wonder why it was hurting you. Wait, what's wrong with four-year-old water. Look, Mr. Wilson, you gotta clean your pool water. Did you not know? Uh, no. Uh, was I supposed to? Uh, yeah, of course you were supposed to, Mr. Wilson. Uh, so that's what that pool cleaning stuff was for in my house. Let me go get it. And, oh my gosh, guys, this Mr. Wilson guy is actually so stupid sometimes. But wait a minute, guys, this gives me an idea. While Mr. Wilson is inside of his house looking for his pool cleaning chemicals, why don't we go ahead and grab ourselves some toilet water? And let's just go ahead and grab this yellow toilet water right over here. And now let's just go ahead and replace all of Mr. Wilson's Wilson's pool water with it. Oh, man. This is actually so funny. Mr. Wilson is gonna freak out when he comes back. Anyways, now let's just quickly go ahead and finish replacing all of it with this. And perfect. Now it's all yellow. All right. I have that pool cleaning stuff. And what? Who beat in my pool? Was it you? Or was it all of you guys? Oh, my gosh. You know what? I'm getting rid of all of you. And wait, what in the world? Mr. Wilson thinks that his mom peed in his pool? Oh, my gosh. This is actually so funny. And wait, you just got rid of all of them. Well, I still wonder if this pool cleaning stuff works. So let me just throw a few of these in here. Oh, and perfect. That worked. All right. Well, the instruction says I got to wait two minutes. So I guess I'll just spawn in new mobs while and, I wait. Oh my gosh. Wait, what in the world? I can't believe Mr. Wilson's pool cleaning chemicals actually work. And wait, he's spawning in even more mobs. Oh gosh. Well, I actually have one more funny idea, which I'm not sure if it's going to work, but it might. Let's go ahead and grab ourselves some of the brown toilet water. And maybe even some of this red toilet water for good measure. And now while Mr. Wilson isn't looking, let's just go ahead and replace all of this nice clean water with some of this brown water and of course throw in a few red water as well just for good measures. All right and there we go. Perfect. It looks just like my local community pool. All right it's been two minutes. So let's go check on the pool and what in the world? Oh, what did you guys do? All right you guys are all going away. And, oh my gosh guys let's go. It actually worked. Mr. Wilson's getting rid of all of his mobs again. You guys need to stop doing that weird stuff in my pool. Oh my gosh. You know we have toilets for this stuff you know. Oh my gosh guys he's just getting rid of all of his guys. This is actually Actually hilarious. All right, I guess I'll just spawn in more mobs inside the house and I'll let them out whenever the walls drop. And, oh my gosh, guys, it is so funny. We made Mr. Wilson want to spawn his mobs inside of his house. Well, anyways, I think it's almost time for the walls to drop, so let's get back over to our side. And perfect, here we are. Let me go ahead and grab some milk so that I'm not invisible anymore. And perfect. Well, anyways, I think we're ready to drop down the walls. How's the army looking, Mr. Scientist? Everything looks perfect. It should be ready to go. All right, excellent. I'll ask Mr. Wilson if he wants to drop the walls. All all right, Mr. Wilson, are you ready to drop down the walls? Because uh, my army sure is. Oh, yeah, let me just let my mobs out of my house real quick. Uh, wait, you put them in your house? Uh, okay. All right, now they're ready. All right, Mr. Wilson, sounds good. I'm about to drop the walls in three. 
two, one, let's go! And what in the world are these guys? There's so many and they're so and small. Wait, Mr. Wilson, I think they just took out your entire army except for like these two over here. What the heck? Oh my gosh, what in the world are these mobs? And oh my gosh, they just destroyed my entire army. What the heck? These skibbity parasites are so powerful. Man, that scientist guy did not let us down this round. You know, these things look so gross. Why are their tongues sticking out? Oh yeah, that part is a little bit gross, but they are so powerful. Wow. Wait, wait a minute, the scientist is back. What is he doing here? Oh, uh, well, Mr. Wilson, you know, he died last round, but he has clones of himself. What, he has clones of himself? Uh, that's against the mob battle rules. What, against what mob battle rule? Mr. Wilson, please show me the mob battle rule book right now, and then if it's in there, then you get the win. Uh, all right, let me just grab the mob battle rule book, and there you go, there it is. Wait, what, you actually have a mob battle rule book and, uh, Wait, Mr. Wilson, this says nothing about a rule about not being able to clone yourself, all right? All right, let's just leave it to the comments. Comment down below who you think won this round. Yeah, just comment down below. Well, anyways, let's just move on to the next round. All right, guys, and it is now the next round. And, man, yeah, we definitely destroyed Mr. Wilson that last round. That was insane. Well, anyways, again, let's look through our one-way glass and see what Mr. Wilson's gonna be spawning. All right, I've been spawning in a bunch of those stupid skibbity toilets, and none of them are doing any good for me. So I think I'm gonna switch sides, and I'm gonna spawn in some of these titan speaker man and wait what in the world he's spawning in a titan speaker man and oh gosh he's spawning in so many of these guys whoa these guys look pretty powerful and, wow yeah they actually do look pretty powerful what the heck all right well where did that scientist guy go i have another question for him and uh guys i don't see him on our side anymore i think he left oh gosh all right well i guess if we don't have the scientist guy on our side anymore do we have to look inside of our chest let's see what we can get and wait a minute what about a titan tv man that sounds like a perfect counter to these titan speaker men so i guess let's just go over here and spawn one in and let's see what this guy's gonna look like and whoa what the heck this guy is massive whoa this guy looks so cool wait look he's got like spikes on top of him oh my gosh and wait are these like propellers over here what in the world okay yeah this guy's definitely gonna help us win this guy is definitely gonna be more powerful than those speaker men look he's literally got speakers on him so he's like a speaker man and a tv man combined well anyways i guess let's just go ahead and start spawning in a few more of them and uh wait what limit reach wait what i can't spawn in any more of these guys oh, oh my gosh well i guess it kind of makes sense this guy does look pretty powerful we probably could win with just like one of them but hmm this guy is kind of small compared to all of mr wilson's mobs i'm not sure but wait i think i have an idea i've got this friend named ricardo and he always has a bunch of really cool stuff maybe i can call him up and maybe he'll have something that we can use to make our titan tv man stronger so i guess let me just go ahead and call him real quick <laughs> Uh, hello? It's Ricardo? Uh, hello? Who's this? Oh, that's Ricardo. It's me, Dash. Oh, Dash, man. What's up? It's been a while. Oh, yeah. It has been a while. It's going good. Well, anyways, I'm currently in the middle of a mob battle, and I just spawned in this Titan TV, man, but he isn't really that big. Oh, so you need the good stuff. That's what you need. Uh, wait, the good stuff? What's the good stuff? Don't worry. Ricardo knows what you need. You just need the good stuff. Uh, okay. If you say so, well, uh, the, could you get me some of the good stuff? Uh, yeah. Just give me about 10 seconds. Seconds. Wait, 10 seconds? Uh, okay. All right, here you go, man. There's the good stuff. Wait, what? Did he just fly in through the sky and... Oh, wait, he dropped us a potion. What in the world? All right, well, let's just go ahead and check this out and... Wait, and upgrade potion wait 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 wait. what in the world is an upgrade potion i've never seen one of these before but i guess let's just go ahead and splash it on our titan tv man over here and oh my gosh guys what in the world look at the size of our titan tv man now this is insane yeah i think it's definitely safe to say that we're probably gonna win this round all right well anyways mr wilson are you ready to drop down the walls uh, yeah i'm ready and oh my gosh my mobs are so op now let's go wait, your mobs are op what did you do to them uh, don't worry about it, Dash. You'll see. Uh, okay. Well, anyways, without any further ado, I guess let's go ahead and drop down the walls in three, two, one. Let's go! And wait, that's all you have for your mob and is just wait, one? What the heck? I, what did you expect? You had one mob. Well, yeah, but did you see his size? That thing was massive. Yeah, but it's a mob army battle. Don't you understand, like, the mob army part? Uh, wait, 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 Mr. Wilson. There is no army in the name. And wait, what did you even do to your guys to make them so strong? Oh, I gave them coffee. Uh, yeah, definitely coffee. Wait, you gave them coffee? Wait, no, no, no. That's against the mob battle rules. What? No, it's not. Uh, come on, Mr. Wilson. We've talked about this. It's obviously against the rules to give them 
performance enhancing substances. Uh, fine, uh, just let the comments decide this again. All right, comment below who you think won this round as well. Anyways, let's just move on to the next and final round. All right, Dash, this is the last round, so no funny business when you're doing this legit by the rules. Okay, yeah, no more coffee or anything like that. This is just gonna be a normal mob battle, and uh, yeah, let, let's do it. And no more clones as well. Oh, yeah, sure. I don't even know where that scientist guy went. Well, anyways, let's start. All right, guys, and of course, the first thing we're gonna do is look through our one-way glass because, like, come on, that's just gonna be our one little thing that we do. And anyways, let's see what Mr. Wilson's gonna be spawning this time. All right, and for the final round, I know exactly what I'm going to do. Ash is never gonna see this coming. I am going to spawn in every single one of my mobs just like this. Wait, wait what the heck? Mr. Wilson's spawning in all of his mobs. And wait, guys, look, the glitch skibbities are still flat. <laughs> but what in the world? He's spawning in all of his guys. This isn't good. Oh, no, what should we do? Well, I guess we could just copy him and spawn in all of our guys as well. But if it's just all of our guys versus all of his guys, then it's just gonna be a tie. Oh no, come on, come on. I gotta think of something. And wait a minute. What if we use this machine that that scientist guy made? I know it kind of broke when he tried to use it, but maybe I could try repairing it or something. I mean, it does look pretty powerful. Surely there's a way that we can fix it. And wait a minute. What are these up here? And wait, turrets? Okay, I see where that scientist guy was going with this. Well, I guess for starters, let's go ahead and replace all of these bad turrets over here with some of these super OP rocket turrets. Okay, yeah, these are gonna be a lot stronger than those turrets that the scientist guy had on initially. And anyways, I think everything should work. Now, let me just check all of the wiring. So we got these wires going into here. And we got these wires connected up over here going into here. Oh my gosh, guys, it is so complicated. I've got no idea how any of this works, honestly, but I really hope it does because just look at Mr. Wilson's army. This is crazy. All right, well, I guess let's just go ahead and hit the button over here and hope for the best. Hopefully it works. Here we go. And okay, it should be activated now. And I guess to test it out, let's go ahead and spawn in a creeper and see what happens. And what the heck? Wait a minute, guys. It just shot the creeper. Oh my gosh, that was so awesome. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We need to try that again. Let me try spawning in like three creepers at once. And what the heck? Those turrets just destroyed those creepers. Okay, yeah, guys, this is definitely gonna be super OP. Let's spawn in like five of them at once. You know what? Forget five. I'm just gonna spawn in as many as I can. Here we go. And oh my gosh. Gosh, guys, okay, yeah, I think we're definitely gonna be able to win this round. All we need is this one rocket turret machine over here. Well, anyways, Mr. Wilson, are you ready to drop down the walls? Because, uh, my army sure is. Uh, I'm more than ready, and there's no way you're gonna get through all of my mobs. Oh, yeah, well, we'll see about that. Anyways, Mr. Wilson, let's go ahead and drop the walls for the final round in three, two, one. Go! What in the world is that? Uh, do you have turrets? What in the world? Uh, this is Don't totally cheating. The... What? No, how is this cheating? The scientist built this for me, and he was one of my mobs, so this is all fair and square. Let's go! Oh my gosh. Well, I guess that means you're right. It is fair. But my guys should be able to win this. Uh, I don't know how, but they just need to take out the turret. And, uh, wait, I think they're out of range of my turret. Oh gosh, they're too far away. Oh my gosh. Whenever they get too close, though, they instantly get fired at. This is crazy. Oh, and it looks like they're coming in for a stealth attack. Come on, toilets and skibbities. Come on. And wait, a stealth attack. I wouldn't call this a stealth attack. They kind of just all ran over here at once. Uh, my rockets are destroying them. Oh my gosh. Come on. Attack the turret. And uh, you've only got a few left, Mr. Wilson. This kind of looks like it's going to be an easy round for me. I can't believe your guys can't take out a single turret over here. A single turret? It's because it's not a mob. I don't know, Mr. Wilson. That kind of just sounds like excuses. Your guys over here kind of look like they're getting destroyed. Like, look at this guy. He's already got like four rockets on him and he's not even using any of them. He's kind of stupid. All right. Well, here they come again. Come on, guys. I believe in you. And, uh, wait, Mr. Wilson. They all just died. That was too easy. What, Dash? That just destroyed all my mobs? That can't be allowed. Well, I don't know, Mr. Wilson. Like I said earlier, my skibbity scientist built it, and he was part of my army, so, you know, it, it's all fair. It, it was part of... It was his doing. Oh, uh, fine. I guess that makes sense, but you win this round, but I'm definitely winning the next video. We'll see about that. If you guys enjoyed that video, make sure to hit like and subscribe so that we can hit 1 million subscribers, and click on one of the videos on the screen if you want to watch more.